All right, guys, so today we are going to be taking a look at the new Battle Rush. So kind of keep that in mind, this thing is going to last for the next two weeks. So you don't really need to rush it through. I, I know in this video, I'm probably going to be using some limited unit to complete this, but you guys have a long time to complete this. So use whatever best option you guys have, whatever good debuffer you guys can use, and then slowly chip through it per day. So as far as the reward wise, uh, if you just complete the first three for example you are able to get 3000 diamonds right off the bat so if that's what you're aiming for you're good to go you don't really need to push it to the extra stage the extra stage simply just gives you a new title so if you offer that be my guess go for that but uh four and five you're good you get your ur custom ticket that's probably like the biggest thing possible right there but other than that what we are trying to aim for is the title so let's see all right so the squad is the same all right i don't think they're going to be changing it anytime soon so i think the biggest problem is definitely going to be new going to be the healer so constantly supplies that hp to the whole squad could be problematic so i think that's going to be the first thing that we will try to take care of and then move on from there so my squad that i've been using for the first five battle is this one so it is all limited obviously so we have the o sasabi zeta unicorn or two unicorns and then we have Gumbly. so i'm gonna start to see if i can make a more free to play friendly or a little bit less uh limited and then we will see how it goes all right so i'm gonna go with something like this so the only limited i have on here is cassie cassie is more just for the tanking same as the full armor gun and thunderbolt so the others that we are using as Kenna, we have kashiki and then we have double zeta and then followed by hama hama so my skinna now is going to be hitting a little bit weaker because i actually did strip all of this unit enhancement i took all of those points back and i added into perfect ability for the clan battle last time around so I never really got the chance to put anything back in here so right now it will be a little bit weaker than it normally is but uh, I think we should be fine I say um, so I'm just gonna hop in after I kind of figure out some of the module issues because uh, yeah I, I've been playing arena with all these unit a lot so they are using more HP base rather than just their full DPS so now I gotta go back in and then change a lot of these all right, so our goal is to take out Neo Gunna first because uh, we just don't like healers. <laughs> as far as the enemy team, we, we we don't like that. So what are we are going to do, I think I'm just going to have uh, Cassie here and then we'll have Thunderbolt right here and then Eskina behind and then just probably like this, I think we should be fine. I don't necessarily know if i want to go for zion at the moment i know it definitely does more unit to our pro tags unit but i feel like taking out hama or not hama, hama quibbly could be a decent option so i think i'll probably go with that and then let's just do two times speed because uh this might actually take a hot minute so i'm just gonna see how cassie is actually cassie cassie is actually doing you know tanking wise is not that bad <laughs> all right um wow did our did our hagashiki even do anything it, it did it actually did but uh dude this team is not enough okay oh dude that was Ada is putting in the works and because he is holding up nice all right yeah it's definitely doing pretty good with the absolute hits so <laughs> that is definitely something i didn't want to uh you know expressed about is is like it's definitely really good and hama hama is kind of putting in the work with the uh, aoe e excuse so yeah but unfortunately this team does fall short a little bit so i'm just gonna see the battle result on this i, I think if we were to re refresh on this team a little bit more i think we should be good all right i think we should be fine so by far cassie is doing a lot of good damage for us that's crazy uh i i know it's a little bit of unit so i think you guys might say well it is a little bit unit so that's why it does more i i know that but um in, in a more realistic situation i think you guys probably have that one maxed out 
you know extreme limited unit or super limited that you guys want to be, you want to be using and i just have happen to have that so yeah we, we we're gonna be using that so i think s can them even without the unit enhancement is still doing good surprisingly enough like were we even hitting the damage mark or are we capping on any damage in here i don't think we were let me see the other guys like yeah I don't think we were ever hitting damage cap. Even for double Zeta, we don't see that. Oh wow, dude, look at that. New Gundam evading that. That's, that's, that's a lost DPS right there. So, yep, that's 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 not good. Because I am using the Benadryl from the perfect ability to stack the damage. So every time our attacks get evaded, that's that's not good. Like 15 times, yeah, that's not that's not good. That is not looking good, man. And then Hagashiki, how fast did we last? Uh, we didn't even last that long, so I think we'll be back. So we, wow, okay. So we were able to take out new Gundam uh, quickly and then banish the NTD. So that's actually a really good sign. So I'm gonna use this team once more time and then we'll see if we can wrap things up. All right, I think this time around, we are going to have Kasti probably target uh, maybe Do. Yeah, I think let's actually do that. And then we will focus our attention on Zeon as well. Yeah, I, I think Zeon is uh, definitely an, another annoyance that we need to take out. So I think we have that. All right, so I think this time around, we'll probably focus on Double Zeta. Let's just kind of see real quick. Yeah, look at all those. Oh, look at all those missiles. That's crazy. All right. So so far, who's doing the AOE attack? Is it? I think it's yeah, right? Yeah, I think so. Oh no, that was it. No, are you kidding me? No. What? Well, that's a shaft right there. All right. I guess we gotta go back to Cassie. Dude, Cassie's killing in in this match. All right, another AOE execute from Hamahama. We will definitely take that. Oh, okay. So it looks like Zeon is the kind of like the leading unit with the cutscene right there. So since we took him down already, we should be in the clear, right? Who's left right now, actually? Is it the O? Let me see. I can't really see from here. Um, it looks like it is the O. Okay, oh, <laughs> we finished things. No, Zeta is the last unit. Uh, that was Zeta. Okay, and we are done. So, I know this is not the most free to play friendly team possible, but I think it definitely takes a little bit more tanking if you are going with this more of more of like a defensive lineup. So, I I mean it worked out pretty good. So, who was the last? One? So, yeah, Eskenem even without the unit enhancement is still doing great works. That's insane. But now let's actually claim all these cool stuff right here so three thousand diamonds and then we also do have another is this another oh zaku 3 psychom type blueprint so that's cool and then we obviously get the UDR custom ticket so that's obviously what we've been looking out for and then the title so let's actually grab that real quick all right i think now with the title we have a few variants of uh i think having harman as the kind of like the image right let me see I think we have another one right over here and then the other one we have was this one so now we have three and two of them are using the same sprite so did it ran out <laughs> yeah but that's that's pretty nice that's for sure but i don't think i'm gonna be keeping that so i'm not gonna be saving that but uh other than that, that is going to be pretty much it in terms of this iteration of the Battle Rush.